Good morning! This is September 2nd and I'm already wearing a cozy sweatshirt because where I live fall has finally come, although probably temporary. I'm still very excited. Um, I woke up to a cool crisp morning and uh, was super excited and I wanted to share with you some wisdom today that I was personally experiencing about talking to ourselves and our constant need to criticize ourselves. Have you ever done that? Probably. Do you ever look in the mirror and just look at the things that you don't like about yourself? Um, I do this a lot and I now that I'm more aware of it, I'm able to try to think my way through. But why is it that we have these negative self-talk um, when I was doing some journaling, I realized that I would never speak to anybody, even if it was somebody I didn't like, the way that I speak to myself, my inner dialogue. Think about that for a second. When something goes wrong or something's frustrating or you're just having a bad time or you make a mistake, right? Um, you would never turn to a friend and say, you're so awful. You're terrible. You're stupid. Um, and time after time, when we consistently have this playing on a constant loop in our subconscious, it really influences the way that we feel about ourselves. And not only that, but how we treat ourselves, how we take care of ourselves, how we think about our bodies. Um, and our bodies are amazing at any stage. If, if you're, you're suffering with something right now and you don't feel your best, your body's still working to heal and it's still working to take care of you, to take care of itself and for survival. And we oftentimes forget that. We forget the connection between our food and what it's actually doing to support us, to give us energy, to help us sleep, to help us metabolize and to help us absorb nutrients. We kind of take that for granted a lot. And even I do that as a nutritionist, which day in, day out, I'm looking at um, food and intake and absorption. And I can get caught up in my work and then realize that I haven't paid attention to myself. So this is an ongoing practice of identifying these things that come up for us and these constant loops of negative self-talk, negative emotion. I mean, when was the last time you gave yourself a compliment? I hope it was today. If it wasn't, take a moment and give yourself a compliment. Wow, this looks really good on me. Or, wow, I'm having a good hair day. Or, you know what, I feel awesome. I got to bed early last night and now I'm gonna drink some water and just start my day off on the right foot. So I just wanted to give you that little tidbit this morning because it was really impactful for me when I was sitting here thinking about uh, how can I help people connect their intuition with their nutrition. And one of the ways is encouraging healthy dialogue with yourself. So let me know if this resonated with you. Any comments below, I'd be happy to show you some love. So I will see you later. Bye.